Hello and welcome to New Life Scientific. My name is Kyle and today I will be showing you the Milestone Pathos Rapid Microwave Histoprocessor. In this video I will go through some of the various functions of the Pathos including raising and lowering the safety shield, moving the cover between the microwave cavity and the wax cavity, transferring reagents from the front tanks to the back tanks, performing a power test, viewing and creating new processes, and viewing and changing wax heating settings. All of these functions are completed using a high precision touch screen interface that can be used either by hand or with the provided stylus. Here you can see that the chamber safety shield is closed. To open the safety shield, simply touch the open safety shield button on the main screen. Once the safety shield is completely raised, the option to lower the shield will become available. Similar to the safety shield, to change the position of the cover, touch the Move Cover button on the main screen. A new screen will pop up that shows the different positions that can be selected for the cover. I have sped up this part of the video. I am not able to lower the racks into the wax chamber because we do not have any wax in the cavity and the system must detect that the wax is melted. To return the racks back to the microwave chamber, touch either the microwave load button or the microwave cavity button. There are multiple options for reagent transfers with the Milestone Pathos. Today I will show only the manual transfer of a reagent between front tank 1 and back tank 1. After selecting your tanks and starting the process, the reagent is transferred from the origin tank to the cavity. The reagent is then transferred from the cavity to the destination tank. There is an automatic reagent transfer option available, which uses the same process to ensure that the back tanks remain filled with reagent from the front tanks. I will now unlock the reagent drawer by touching the release drawer button. This allows me to open the reagent drawer. Once in this drawer, you can view or change the reagents in the tanks. While it is possible to fill the back tanks manually by removing them, the easiest and best option is to fill only the front tanks and use the prior shown process to transfer the reagents to the back tanks. When you are ready to close the door, make sure and touch the lock drawer button on the touch screen. Most system functions are not possible while the drawer is unlocked. Here you can see the service screen for the Pathos system. This screen displays various information about the system including reagent tank levels. From this screen you may also perform a power test which measures the microwave output power of the system. This power test consists of loading cool water into the microwave chamber and then microwaving it. The before and after temperatures are then compared to determine the output power of the microwave. You will see the results at the end of the test. This screen displays all available histoprocessing protocols. You may select how many rack layers you wish to process, each layer able to hold 64 samples. After you have selected the number of layers, select the correct protocol. After selecting a protocol, you will see a list of all available standard and custom programs for the selected protocol. You may also create a custom protocol by touching the New button at the bottom of the screen. A window will then appear that allows you to adjust all of the parameters and steps of your custom protocol. Lastly, from the Wax Heating Settings page, you are able to adjust various settings related to the wax, such as timers, preheating time, temperatures, and stir speed. You are also able to manually set the wax as ready, but this may have a negative effect on any program that you may run. New Life Scientific has years of experience dealing with a wide variety of tissue processors from various manufacturers, and we have determined that the Milestone Pathos is the most automated, robust, user-friendly tissue processor on the market. Unfortunately, most individuals are unfamiliar with the Pathos system and thus stick with the more traditional processing brands such as Secura and Leica. We understand the concerns that come with buying unfamiliar equipment, which is why we have made this video. Please contact us if you have any other questions about this system or any of our other items. Thanks for watching.